Hello everybody, I'm Brian Jorsett with Hilltop Camper and RV, standing in front of Jayco's Eagle HT 29.5 BHDS half ton towable bunkhouse fifth wheel. Uh, on the front here we've got a gel coat front cap. We've got some accent lights. Right underneath here is the switch for those. You've got the uh, Kurt turning point pin box on this model. It's going to allow you to do a 90 degree turn without having to buy a slider hitch for your fifth wheel hitch. This can uh, make those tight turns with a shorter bed pickup. And underneath up front here you're going to have storage for batteries. Uh, if you were to option for a generator that would go right up underneath here. We've got fiberglass vacuum bonded sidewalls. A lot of brands are going to pinch roll their sidewalls. Jayco has a vacuum bonded sidewall where they put it on a press with 144 tons of pressure for 16 minutes. It's the right way to laminate the sidewalls so that you are reducing the chances of having delamination on your fiberglass over the years of ownership. You've got a large electric awning with the LED lights here. You've got pass through storage in the front located next to the propane tanks. Nice size storage in here. The beam and table that you're seeing right there on the right is for a exterior griddle which mounts right in the back by the outside kitchen in the J-Port location. So you can have your griddle next to the outside kitchen. You've got the nice more ride, step above steps. These are very easy to put up and down. A lot of brands, they slam down when you open the door. This is gonna stop wherever you let it stop. And it's easy and lightweight to get up and down for your steps. And very sturdy with the handrail here. You've got a safety grab handle as well there. Uh, Jayco has the four star handling package on their Eagle HT fifth wheels. That's gonna give you the uh, Goodyear Endurance tire. You've got uh, tire pressure monitoring stems built right in. You've got aluminum rims. And then you've also got heavy duty Dexter axles, wet bolt fasteners, and in between the axle you'll see a More Ride 3000 uh, suspension system using rubber to absorb the shock and uh, rigors of driving down the road with these. This has a four-point electric leveling system. You see two of the controls here, or two of the legs here, two in the front there. Auto leveling, push a button, and it's done. Real simple, uh, so you can get to camping. Uh, you'll notice on the 2023 product now, we've got prep for a security camera on the side, up above the door there. Uh, that's going to be similar to the backup cameras that are prepped on these. Um, and then you can also get side view cameras so that you can get a total monitoring system. You turn on your turn signal, it's going to show you what's down the sides on each uh, side of your fifth wheel when you're traveling. The backup camera helps you seeing behind you and now you can see who's outside your door with a little security camera. You've got outside speakers. Uh, Jayco's going to have the strongest roof in the industry, 4,500 pounds capacity on this roof. Uh, they have more space up there. To, by making it strong, they're creating more space in the trusses so that you're also maximizing your insulation values. And it tapers from five inches in the center down to three on the side walls in the corner. Most brands are going to taper down to barely anything, and really there's no space for insulation on the sides of the roof when it tapers down there. Uh, we've got the Climate Shield package on all Jayco Eagle HT fifth wheels. They've ducted the furnace down into that area. It's a larger furnace. This is going to be a 35,000 BTU furnace. Uh, and then you've got the enclosed underbelly where your tanks are heated, enclosed. They test it down to zero, up to 100. Uh, to show you those temperatures, they report it on their website, unlike a lot of brands that just throw out some unreasonable R values. Uh, but uh, you've got insulation underneath there, and then they wrap the roof of the fifth wheel with uh, astrofoil to help 
protect also with extra insulation there. And then you'll see in the uh, storage compartments, if you look up underneath there, you can see the astrofoil in the bathroom and bedroom areas underneath there so that you've got better insulation up there as well. On the back of the fifth wheel, if you want to come back this way, you'll see we've got a nice sized outside kitchen with a sink, some drawer space. Again, this J port opens up and that port, uh, you slide in the beam and the tabletop up there and it comes with a cooktop griddle and there's a quick connect for that right down below so you can tap into your propane tanks that are already on here. In the back here, we've got Jayco's towing package. So this is going to give you 3,000 pounds of towing. It's ready to go. You've got the safety chain hooks, 300 pound hitch rating up and down. And you've got uh, the four pin wiring connection back there with the two inch receiver. Uh, in the back here, you're also going to have huge storage underneath. Uh, I can't open that right now, but underneath the bunk beds, there's large storage for other items that you bring along on your camping trip. Fully walkable roof, like I said, so, of course, it's got a roof ladder. Again, you can see back here, it's prepped for your backup cameras. The sides are prepped for the side view cameras. And also, um, with Jayco's lighting system, you'll notice these lights have white tail lights. So, these actually are reverse lights. That's part of the J Smart lighting package on the sides. When you turn on your turn signal, it's going to flash all the marker lights on the side so that others around you are aware that you're going to make a maneuver on the road. And when you uh, turn on your hazards, it's also going to flash on the rear and sides as well. Let's head on inside and take a look at some of the interior features of the Jayco Eagle 8 e products. Over here, we've got theater seats that are wall hugger theater seats. So these recline out and you've got cup holders there. You can option for a trifold hide a bed if you're looking for more sleeping space. Um, you can option for that. You've got the MCD roller shades, of course, like we talked about. Nice big windows that open up as well. Some manufacturers, they just have windows here that don't actually open up. Uh, you're going to have your uh, Insignia Smart TV here. Uh, this is a JBL stereo system. And you've got outside speakers as well. And then you've got the Furion fireplace down there. That's an electric space heater as well. So it does actually have some function to it where if it's a little bit colder in the morning and you want to take that chill out of the air, you can save your propane and not run the furnace and just turn that on if you're already plugged in and uh, paying for a campsite with electric uh, options. Another huge hidden option here that uh, we're really excited about is the hidden... Um, we've got a, let me undo this strap here. This is a hidden pantry on uh, this model. So as you can see, that's adding a ton of storage to the kitchen area here with that walk-in pantry. Just past the kitchen and living room area here, we've got Jayco's strongest bunks in the industry. These are uh, 600 pound rating. Of course, just like the floor, instead of OSB, Jayco's using plywood. Um, so plywood bed bases, dinette bases, the floor all throughout, even your roof, 3 8 inch plywood uh, decking. You've got wardrobe space back here, some nice drawers for the kids, uh, some drawers down here built in, not a wasted spot for storage. They do have the uh, emergency exit window back here, and both the bunks also have windows there. There's some storage cubbies, which will give you a peek into those here in a second. And you've got USB outlets for the kids in here. There's even a spot if you wanted to mount an extra TV, and then each kid has a bunk light. And this area is closed off with the nice solid wood pocket door here. So you can close that off, put the kids to bed, still stay awake, play cards, watch TV, um, there. Alright, let's take a look up at the bathroom and bedroom now. Alright, in the Jayco bathroom here in the Eagle HT, you're going to have a porcelain foot flush toilet, a nice spacious neo-angle shower with shower surround. You've got the powered roof vent up above with a skylight as well. 
And new for 2023 is the tankless gas water heater. Your controls are over here by the sink. And you've got a nice size sink with storage underneath and a vanity that actually opens and there is storage available. The Jayco Eagle HTs come standard with a queen 60 by 80 residential size mattress. You can option for a king size mattress in this one as well. You've got storage underneath the bed, lift up on gas struts. And then you've got closet space on both sides. Huge windows in the bedroom area to make it feel more open, as well as wardrobe and storage drawers in the slide out wardrobe. Here we have Jayco exclusive J Command by BM Pro Systems. This is a screen that's going to allow you to control lights, uh, your slide out motors, see how full your tanks are, check your battery levels. Uh, you're going to be able to control the furnace and air conditioning on this screen. You can even use your auto leveling system on this screen. And there's some troubleshooting apps on it as well. Um, it's a, basically a tablet. Um, also, you can program your phone to uh, have the capability of pulling up an app on your phone to uh, control the things like the lights and the slides and the awnings as well with your phone. So um, if you're a tech savvy person, this is going to be very convenient um, next level technology for your, your RV systems. Thanks for checking out our video on the Jayco Eagle HT half ton towable bunk model fifth wheel in the 29.5 BHDS. Stop in and see for yourself while this has become one of the number one selling fifth wheels in the United States.